All right. So here's the new uh, ZR 2.6 configuration. So here we have the left front left actuator. So basically what I did different on this one is that uh, this is a motor mount inspired by ZR 2.8 that was never released. So much stronger, much stiffer as a part and much uh, simpler to, to print. So this one prints without any support. So the slope right over here will allow um, to print without any support. Bearing is simply pressed. There is a little play, just enough, so it's nice and snug in there and secure. The weight of the bed will keep it down. And it fits NEMA 17 motor, just as usual, just a different look. Now, if we move up here for the, uh, the attachment to the bed, uh, major change is that we have now the wobble rings, that uh, wobble X, should I call them, so those are inspired by the design that Oleg uh, did a while back. So Wobble X, this one is for a SFU-1204 ball screw. And uh, all credit goes to uh, Evomoto Oleg, my good friend Oleg. So very, very good design. This thing works awesome. I do have ball screws that are out of whack by way too much. And these things can compensate everything that the ball screw will throw at it. This one will just simply uh, stabilize everything. Um, this part was revised as well. So a lot more meat on it to make it more stiff, to make it more solid. Although we never saw, I never saw or heard about any of those component cracking. So, which is a good thing. And yeah, that's it. So. Um, we're not losing, although we're adding a lot of uh, layers over here, uh, we're not losing as much height, Z height, since we have integrated those uh, roller, those pin support for the ball to sit on into that part. And uh, thanks to uh, Hickey, who was with us the other night uh, during the design, who brought the idea of uh, making them, was it Hickey or Kino? I, I can't remember. Sorry, guy. Um, so basically, what I, what I was saying is that we made it in a manner that you should be able to print this without support. Uh, so those overhangs uh, should be able to print like this, sitting on that surface. And the only place that this part might need support is right over here, since this overhang might be complicated. I could have tried to cut it straight. Um, but simple, small support there, and you're going to be uh, covered. So, yeah, that's it. ZR 2.6, that's the first strut completed. Now we're going to tackle right hand, which is going to be very simple. It's simply a mirror, this one, and then the rear one uh, that is uh, going to have to be retouched. I might give this one a bit of uh, flavor of the day chamfers and just a, a refreshed look. Let me know if uh, you'd like to see something else for this component. If uh, clearance or adaptation to other stuff around the printer, just let me know uh, and I'll try to incorporate as much as I can. Thank you for being here and happy printing.